Hey gamers, Tony here back again from the ClassicLeap.com Gaming Electronic Podcast with another iOS review. Today I'm taking a look at the game Catapult King brought to you by developer Wicked Witch and the publisher Chilingo. This game was released in the App Store today, June 7, 2012 for 99 cents. And it is a universal app, which is always nice. It works on your iPad, iPhone, and iPod Touch. And even has Retina Display Graphics for your iPad 3, if you're lucky enough to have one. Um, this game is Game Center enabled as well. So let's get into the logistics of the game, the story. Uh, basically, in Catapult King, it's kind of the favorite retro gamer story. The dragon has come in, or whoever has come in and stolen the princess and there's little minions and basically you have your catapult and you have your rocks and you need to go rescue the princess and what you're gonna find here and if I can say it in the simplest way possible catapult king is a 3d angry birds and that is a great great thing because we know angry birds is an amazing game it's been sold billions and billions of copies there's tons of people who tried to copy the game and rehash it and never really works out right but I hardly ever see someone doing a 3D version of that puzzle shooting genre the physics based genre and that's what developer Wicked Witch has done and I love it I love the 3D it works really really well and so basically with your catapult you get your standard rocks and you also get uh, throughout the game you'll unlock things like a fire rock and a, a, a smasher rock that kind of goes right through cement stone walls and then also with each level that you complete you also get magic points and with the magic points what you can do is buy special rocks for your catapult you can buy things like a lunar strike which brings down these comets from the heavens and they rain down on your enemies you can also do like an earthquake rock and then there's also a guided rock as well so there's over 60 levels to play and the premise of this game is simple it's, it's very much like an Angry Birds style game there's these little minions that have worked with the dragon to steal the princess and basically these minions are placed throughout the level on different castles on sometimes in different houses on different uh, platforms and you basically need to knock those down knock all the minions down in the level with your catapult in order to pass the level so as you can see here in the game and so once you knock a minion over knock it on the ground um, basically they explode and uh, yeah you knock them all down to win the level and so I was really pleased with how a lot of these levels were crafted how a lot of the minions were placed it was a lot of fun um, to strategize and try to knock them all down to to beat the levels now a couple of the areas that I, I struggled with in this game is occasionally I'd see a glitch where I would shoot my rock and it would go right through a minion but that was only once in a great while it's a very minor complaint the only other complaint is that there is a camera mode where you can kind of look around the 3D world before you shoot, but every once in a while there'll be minions placed inside of a castle and you have no idea they're there until you've already failed the level. And so it makes it hard to see some of the minions sometimes, but really those are minor complaints. This is a 99 cent app with over 60 levels. It's a lot of fun. I've been addicted to it all day. I highly recommend you pick it up, especially if you kind of love that physics-based Angry Birds style genre because the 3D is really, really refreshing. The catapult and the physics works very well. And I was very, very happy with Catapult King. Wicked Witch did a fantastic job. I recommend you go out and pick this one up today. This has been Tony from the ClassicLeak.com Gaming Electronic Podcast. Make sure you like and favorite our video and subscribe to our channel for more reviews. Have a great day.